Hey YouTube, welcome back to a brand new video. Now earlier today, Nintendo finally announced the next Nintendo Direct that will of course air tomorrow, June 21st, which for those still playing Animal Crossing falls on the summer solstice and the longest day of the year, which is pretty cool. Anyway, Nintendo have confirmed it will be around 40 minutes long, full of information focused primarily on Nintendo Switch games launching in the second half of 2023 and include currently unreleased details on Pikmin 4, which is super exciting. Pikmin 4 looks so much fun, so it'll be pretty awesome to see more gameplay. Now, you can catch the Nintendo Direct at 3 p.m. UK time tomorrow or 7 a.m. Pacific and 10 a.m. Eastern for those in the US. Now, as always, Nintendo went pretty quiet before dropping this announcement and haven't really confirmed what exactly they'll be covering other than Pikmin 4 at this point. So the question is, will Animal Crossing get a mention or some kind of announcement? I don't want to get anyone's hopes up, so I'm going to say probably not. Now, that's not because I think a port or a spin-off isn't coming, because I think it is. I just doubt Nintendo would want to affect the marketing for Pikmin, given that's the next big Nintendo title coming to Switch after Zelda. Plus, it's just a little early. Personally, I am expecting something this year, but I would probably bet it's more likely to be around the holidays, and if anything is eventually announced, would probably fall in another Direct later in the year. Historically, Nintendo have announced new waves of DLC and larger DLC updates and spin-offs for New Horizons and past games around the autumn time. So yeah, whilst I would love to see some Animal Crossing news, and whilst there's a chance of course, given the sheer success of New Horizons, I'm still pretty confident it's a little too early in the year. With that said, Nintendo are beyond unpredictable. I'm almost certain their board will be pressuring them to milk Animal Crossing given its phenomenal sales figures, and their tweet says they'll be focusing on games releasing later this year, which there aren't actually that many that we know of. So yes, there's a tiny chance Animal Crossing could see a spin-off, but as always, it's anyone's guess. Again, personally, I think it's more likely to be in the autumn if anything is announced this year, but we can hope. What do you think about this Nintendo Direct and are you looking forward to hearing more about Pikmin? Be sure to let us know your thoughts in the comments. Thank you so much for watching and if you want to learn more about the evolution of balloon presence in Animal Crossing, be sure to check out this next video. Peace.